my heart to go out here and just bless some people. You know, just do something nice for a few people, you know. You know, the, the smallest things you do can you know, really touch people's heart, give people hope. Well, I think we just found a few people we can bless. It's rough out here, man. I'm going to go ahead and look out for some people and try to make them they day better. I want to look out for you, man. I know it's rough out here. Hey, man. Bro, take the 20. Take the 20, man. Uh, thanks, bro. You all right? You. All right no, man. man. My back is killing me, bro. All right, man. Hey, how you doing, man? Good, man. Just felt like doing something good for somebody. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name, man? You look good. There you go. Uh, That's for you. Man. That's for you. Thank you very much, bro. And God bless you. That's for you. You got a phone, it don't look like you need no money. <laughs> you got a phone, right? <laughs> I'm just out here, man. I just said I wanted to help somebody out, man, huh? It don't have no service. Hey man, let me get a picture. Oh, you got a phone too. Hey man, it ain't on there. Hey, y'all up in here, but y'all sure got phones. Hey man, I got a picture with phone. You just got a jail? Yeah. It's all right, man. You know. They sold them everything. Bypass. I gave my friend $35 for my bicycle, get my bag, and two phones. I got one. He's gone. Oh, yeah? I got my bag back in. Oh, okay. The running back for the Raiders. You look for me. Say what? The running back for the Raiders. Running back for the Raiders? Me? No, you two? Nah. <laughs> I know who you are. I ain't no running back, man. I'm good, man. Hey, I'm just a hardworking brother, man, trying to just look out for people. That's all. Hey, man. I know you. God, man. You don't know me, man, but it's cool. Who am I? Yeah. <laughs> just tell me your name, man. My name is Rodney, man. Rodney. Yeah. Rodney. Rodney. Let's call Rodney. me Rodney, man. Dude, Rodney. <laughs> I, I know. Come on. Please. Let's call me Rodney, man. Look at they taking pictures of my car. What y'all doing, man? Hold up. Y'all the police? Y'all all taking videos of me? I'm taking videos of y'all? No, we're going to take a picture. We're going to take a picture of your car. Oh, y'all want to take a picture? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I ain't know what was going on. <laughs> Take a picture of it myself. <laughs> you know, take a, I'm gonna take a picture of myself. Uh huh. Beautiful. Hey man, but you know what? What I did for y'all, that's why I'm blessed like this. I'm you know? When I do stuff good, good I'm things come to me. I'm yeah, man. Preacher? Nah. I know. Well, actually, yeah, I am a preacher. I'm not. I'm a. I'm not a preacher. In the typical way, you would call it a preacher, but, you know, I just try to help people out. Man, I just want y'all to understand that that's how y'all get blessed, man. You go give gifts to somebody. You see, I just walked up on four dudes, or three, was it was three or four, I don't even know what it was. Three or four dudes by myself in a dark area. I don't care. I know I got the blessings on me. I know God going to protect me. I have no fear of nothing or no one. Let's just make that clear. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just walked up on... They could have easily just tried to jump in my car, rob me, stick me with something. Ain't nobody worried about that. I have no fear of that happening to me. You know? It is what it is, man. You got to you gotta step out on faith that God's going to protect you. I just have that faith. He's going to protect my family. He's going to protect my life. He's going to protect my, my, uh, my safety. You know? He's going to protect my finances. He's going to protect everything. You know, I just had, I just live by that. You know, so this is what you guys got to understand. You know what I'm saying? Step out on faith. I'll tell you a story real quick. You know, when, now many of y'all probably seen my video about when, uh, probably seen my video. I say how my, my uh, girlfriend saved me and, you know, she was there for me when I was broke and blah, blah, blah and all that, whatever. But, you know. Before she came along, I was I was stuck down in Florida by myself. 
I was stuck down in Florida by myself with no money, no income, no nothing. And um, I was by myself. This is before, you know, we was together and we had a child, etc. blah, blah, blah. And I was stuck down here by myself. And, you know, I had to sell the furniture that I had just to get some money to even survive down here. You know, and and then so what happened was, you know, my last, I mean, I was down to, you know, the money had ran out from all the furniture I had, you know, I was make sure it's still recording. The money had ran out from all the furniture I had and all of that, you know, and so I was down to my last few hundred dollars. I was about to be put out. And I just prayed, man. I just prayed that you know, God would bring me somebody that would be there for me. You know, somebody that that would come in my life and be there for me and help me make it through until I got my life together. Cause I didn't, I didn't want to go back home. I didn't want to go back to my parents' house and nothing like that. You know. And I took a hundred dollar bill. I was down to like my last few hundred dollars. I stepped out on faith. I took a hundred dollar bill. I took it up to a church and they had like an offering box. Never been to the church before at all. They had an offering box. And I took that hundred dollar bill and I just put it in the offering box. And I just like stepped out on faith. I said, you know what, I'm gonna give and I'm gonna see what happened. You know, and I just believed in it. I believed in that hundred dollar bill. I believed that hundred dollar bill was going that I gave to the church was going to change my life and it brought the right people in my life to change my life you know it brought it brought me somebody who was going to be there for me who was you know you know when thinking that I was trying to use her or nothing like that I don't need to use nobody you know what I'm saying but sometimes people just go through rough times and you know she was there for me. she took me when I was broke you know what I'm saying when I ain't had nothing Right, so I'm just my whole point is not to be all sentimental and all that. It's just and it, it don't even necessarily you know it's not just about her or whatever. It's it's just about the fact that look, you gotta step out on faith, man. You gotta believe, and when you show God that you are, are gonna step out on faith and you believe and you really truly believe, then you know what I'm saying good things are happen. A lot of y'all believing in gambling. You know what I'm saying? A lot of y'all believing in going to the casino and, and spending all your money trying to get ahead. You know what I'm saying? Just as quick as, you know, a lot of people that get lucky. You know what I'm saying? You know how fast they lose that money? You know, a lot of people, they may get lucky gambling, but when they actually lose all their money, they even go further in the hole than they was when they actually was broke and when they won it. You got to have faith, man. You got to do, do things like I'm doing. Show God you want to help people. I've been doing, I've been showing y'all this for the longest. I don't have to do this. I can keep all my money to myself. But I know, I know in my heart that what I'm doing is a right thing. And it's not up to me to judge what somebody do with the money. Don't matter. I'm showing God that I'm going to have faith in, in helping people and, and, and faith in him. And that's just what it is. You know, and it works. It works. So try to go bless somebody. You know what I'm saying? Try to go bless somebody. Go look for some, somebody to bless. You see, I just went and looked for them people to bless. Go look for somebody to bless. And, and see what you can, you know what I'm saying? See what you can do. See, see how it changed your life. You know, step out on faith. Even if you barely got any more money, that's when you really show God that you have faith in Him. You know what I'm saying? Go do something for somebody. Not because you feel sorry for them, but because you want to show God that you believe in them. And that when you give, you shall receive. Alright guys, peace.